Hey guys, how are you? It's Barry Thiel here. Um, anyway, just wanted to show you a close up look at the new 3D polisher. This thing is the cat's ass so far. Um, anyway, I already opened it. I got a little greedy and I was excited. I haven't touched the machine yet. Um, and so when it came, I wanted to see it. So I apologize, but I put it all back in the box somewhat the way it should come and so you guys can take a look at it. Anyway, it comes in this incredible box. A uh, cool picture of a black Lamborghini on it. Um, it says HD, no more swirls, all in one polish and wax. You've got the pads here, you've got HD speed bottle, a couple microfibers. Anyway, let's check it out. This is one of the coolest things so far about this polish. I'm absolutely impressed with the packaging that 3D went into this thing. Look at this case. Solid, rugged, heavy duty, black case. I, impressive, extremely impressive. I love it to death. Um, you know, as a detailer, when I, when I do occasionally do mobile jobs, I can imagine just taking this thing, putting it in my truck or my van, um, and you know what? No, I'm not worried, it's safe. It is, it's protected. Good piece of equipment. Comes with locking clips. And then when you open it, everything's inside. Now keep in mind, the machine has plastic. The microfibers were all pretty when I got it. Um, you know, the speed was set up. It looked good, but I opened it, like I said. Got greedy, and I had some fun. Um, anyway, comes with two standard green microfibers. These would be the HD Super Towels. These were designed for paint. Um, they're cool enough, but as detailers and enthusiasts, we all know what microfiber towels are. Okay, cool. Thank you, 3D. Let's get back into the nitty gritty. You got a great pamphlet. Talks about all the the new HD line, um, which is a lot actually. You know, recently HD added the polish. They added speed. Um, tells you a little bit about HD Touch, the HD Clay, the HD Free, um, Poxy. Actually, this is probably my favorite page, Poxy and Nitro Steel. Two of my, I love these products, especially Nitro Steel. Um, highly recommend them. Anyway, we got all that. That's cool, that's cool. Um, actually, this is pretty impressive too. For the everyday enthusiast, um, you know, they got the paint tech system. It actually breaks down what clear coat is, um, talks about layers of paint, paint contamination, Whoever thought of this, incredible idea. I love it. Nothing like an educated consumer um, or detailer or enthusiast. Once you're educated, you're going to love paint. And then, of course, it's got some really cool 3D shirts, hats that, you know, tells you what it is, part numbers. Pretty cool little pamphlet. Definitely worth a read. I've seen them before, read through them before. So let's move on. Okay. Comes with 16 ounces of HD speed. Uh, in my personal opinion, I love it. I am not, well, put it this way, I never was a fan of all-in-ones. Um, tried several of them. I'm more of a type of guy that likes to compound, polish, do what it takes. HD Speed, however, I was first introduced to this at SEMA last year um, when I was out there. A lot of you guys may know Thomas Takani. He was out there with me and the rest of the 3D's craft. Ben, Tonch, Juan, hey guys, how are you? Nice to see you again. Um, HD Speed, I love this product. Waiting for it for a while to come out. Uh, it's great. It's simple, it's easy, and it's effective. Um, it removes your everyday swirls. Pretty much, you can give this machine, this polisher, and this setup to anybody, and they'll correct the car. Anyway, so we got quick light paint correction liquids and protection. Detailing made simple, remember that. That's very huge. You don't need a thousand products. Um, you know, keep it simple. HD Speed will help you do that. Alright, so it comes with some tools. The tool will actually, and actually the information about the machine. Wow, this actually comes with brushes. Not many machines come with extra brushes. So when the brushes go bad, you've got replacement brushes. That's pretty impressive. Um, and then it also comes with the handle to remove the backing plate. If you want to go larger, smaller, the wrench. 
Uh, check it out. Standard wrench. Cool. We got all that out of the way. Let's see what else is in here. Okay, it comes with three pads as well. These are the new HD 5.5 inch pads. I've got the yellow cutting, the green medium cut and polish, and the black. I'll tell you what, this pad here, amazing. Uh, if you don't have them, you get them. Love them to death. Alrighty. Now, the bad boy. Let me get rid of this big case. Get this out of my way. Give me a moment here. My belly gets in the way sometimes, so that'll work around it. I've learned to do that. Alrighty. Comes with a vacuum plate. Soft, good vacuum plate. Feels pretty solid. Um, the manufacturer is uh, hard to tell at this moment of the vacuum plate, but hey, it's a good vacuum plate. Feels pretty good. Um, okay, comes with the side handle. You can be able to screw it into this side and to this side. So if you're left-handed, right-handed, great. Uh, me personally, I recommend these for the enthusiast, the everyday amateur, uh, but it works if you like it, cool. Personally, I don't like these. Um, over the years, I've got comfortable holding the machine my personal way. Uh, anyway, so let's put that to the side and look at this machine. Okay, one thing, take notice. If you can, I'll try and get it up to the camera here. Hopefully you can see it. Right there, UL listing. That means this machine is UL listed. So what's that mean? To get a machine UL listed is pretty big to do. Pretty much that means this machine's been dropped, tossed, thrown, played with the whole nine yards, and for UL to say it's UL listed, that's a pretty big deal. That means it's industrial strength. Uh, okay, when I look at it, it says here it runs 2,500 to 68 oscillations per minute. Keep in mind, first time ever touching this machine, playing with it, so I know nothing about it. Um, now the handle up top, one of the things as a detailer, if we're looking at the Grios machine, actually this is the sure hold, pretty similar to the Grios. Um, usually when you pull the bail handle off, these, this feature here, it always slides. So you got to bolt them in on the sides. Um, I typically just use the bolts that come with it. But sometimes you got the metal, you should tape them, but uh, I don't know, I like to live on the edge a little bit, I guess you could say I don't. Um, what's cool about this particular machine, so normally we put the screws in here to keep this tight. It's already screwed in, so you don't have to worry about that no more. Uh, pretty cool, it's those little things that make it the biggest difference. Okay, compared to the Surehold and the so this machine is a heavier, no doubt about it. Oh, excuse me, I had a burp. Oh, feels good. All right, this machine is heavier. Um, feels rugged, feels sturdy, feels extremely solid. Uh, up top, try to get a good close view of this for you. Up top, it's a little different than normal. But what I do like is for guys like us, we're putting the palm for when we apply down pressure. The palm, that's a good comfortable grip. Solid. Um, yeah, I like that a lot actually. Can't wait to play with it and try it. Uh, the backing plate, if you want a close look at the head, the backing plate, here's a little bit of the machine. Okay, on the side, I mean on the back actually, is the speed dial. Pretty cool. Cords offset to the left a little versus in the center. Kind of like that actually. Um, and then you got the side trigger. All right, let me bring it back. I'm going to plug it in here. Check it out. Now, the cord. You see me stand up. I am personally five foot nine. You take off this hat and show you the cool hairdo. It's got a cut, actually. It looks pretty good, I think. A little messed up. Uh, I'd say it's about six feet, six and a half feet from the floor up. A little shorter, uh, but you know what? I find that anytime you use a machine, you always need an extension cord. So, pretty good with that. Uh, Alrighty. You got the whole profile barrack deal here. Fat is prosperous. Alright, remember that. Now, let's get this bad boy plugged in. Alright, what I'm going to do is turn it on. Feels pretty good. Speed one, 
Thank you. 